And in foreign news, leading U.S. infectious disease expert Anthony Fauci on Tuesday warned Congress that a premature lifting of lockdown could lead to additional outbreaks of the deadly coronavirus, which has killed 80,000 Americans and brought the economy to its knees. Fauci, director of the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, told a U.S. Senate panel that states should allow health experts recommendations to wait for signs, including a declining number of new infections, before reopening. President Donald Trump has been encouraging states to end a week-long shuttering of major components of their economies, but senators heard a sobering assessment from Fauci when he asked by Democrat about a premature opening of the economy. So my, my word has been, and I've been very consistent in this, that I get concerned if you have a situation where the dynamics of an outbreak in an area are such that you are not seeing that gradual over 14 day decrease that would allow you to go to phase one. And then if you pass the checkpoints of phase one, go to phase two and phase three. What I've expressed then and again is my concern that if some areas, cities, states, or what have you, jump over those various checkpoints and prematurely open up without having the capability of being able to respond effectively and efficiently, my concern is that we will start to see little spikes that might turn into outbreaks. So therefore, I have been being very clear in my message to try to the best extent possible to go by the guidelines, which have been very well thought out and very well delineated.